Hey guys, good morning. Picking up the camera after quite a bit. I think it's been like a week and a half to two weeks. And for me, at least for the past year, this is like the longest I've gone without like picking up the camera and talking to you guys. Last week, what did I do? It was kind of like a busy, busy week at work and I was editing another video. So if you didn't check out last week's video, definitely go check it out. I'll leave it linked down below. And then this past weekend was Labor Day or Memorial Day week. I always get confused with each of them. I was like doing something every single day on Friday I had a half day so then I hung out with some of my home friends didn't really vlog and then on Saturday I had family come over and then on Sunday I actually went into the city and then I went to my friend's grad party I know a really late grad party but that was really fun and then on Monday I went into the city Monday which was yesterday I went into the city with my parents and we rode bikes around Central Park we ate some good food we tried to get into Ruby's but Ruby's always has a long wait and I just want to eat at Ruby's every single time I go like it's always so busy and then we went to Van Leet Van Leeuwen's for ice cream and I tried a new flavor this time it was like a churro one and it was honestly like really really good and now it's Tuesday and I have work I just want and pick up myself with some Duncan in between meetings because I am so dead literally so dead today I don't know why I literally can't keep my eyes open even though I slept for like nine or ten hours I don't know so we're gonna work and I'm gonna take you guys along my work week there will probably be some apartment hunting this week I sent in a few requests to get some tours this next few weeks is gonna be so busy because Ishika and I oh yeah roommate reveal I'm living with Ishika we'll definitely talk about it when I see her this week when we record the pod but I'm living with Ishika and we're planning on moving like the first week of October end of September whenever we can get an apartment honestly if we find something nice we're just gonna sign the lease so these next few weeks are gonna be busy but I'm excited to take you guys along it's gonna be so good I'm going into the city day to apartment hunt and it's literally raining all day today so I stuck on a hat and I'm wearing all black with some pants I think I'm gonna stick on some boots just because I don't know I feel like in New York City whenever it rains it like tends to like flood a little bit so I'm gonna bring some boots like my docks I think and a work day I'm gonna have a whole work day today and then I am going to go look at apartments afterwards so let's go <laughs> Lately I've been thinking about the choices I have made and doubt the life I've chosen for myself I wonder how it would pan out if I stuck to the status quo and stayed in England never know But when I see my friends I see them with this golden glow It seems they can touch the rainbow I'm currently working at a WeWork in this like little phone booth for a second because I have a call in like five minutes or so. A busy day if I'm being completely honest and it's been raining all day and I'm trudging through the rain. I put my hair up in a bun because it just, it wasn't going to work anymore. I'm wearing all black. It's the vibe. Even my boots are black. I pulled out my docks because I'm scared of puddles. But yeah, lots of work today. I'm going to go look at some apartments after work. I'm going to look, go look at three. Try to finalize the last appointment and then I think that's going to be it and hopefully I can apply to at least one or two of those that way I'm all set and I feel like I just have a really good feeling about like the apartments that I'm seeing today so I'm excited I have some coffee with me we're gonna grind girl boss mode girl on the go we're doing it all so the first apartment that I ended up seeing was actually a really good one the number one thing I feel like you guys know is I love natural light and the fact that this place had literally so many windows like there was literally a window in the bathroom and it was just like so bright and so airy like I could feel the good vibes every bedroom had that and I felt like it was just like very clean there was lots of space kind of it was a bit on the smaller side like we kind of felt like a lot of the bedrooms were a little smaller but I loved 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 the exposed brick and I feel like there was just like a lot of greenery in the back in the front I don't know this one was a really really good one and a really good contender we absolutely loved it and the second place we ended up seeing was actually the one that I kind of liked more in the pictures just because of the fact that the living room in this place was a lot bigger than the other one I felt like there was just like more living space um, the kitchen was a little smaller but it wasn't too bad and two of the bedrooms were really big but one of them was just so small it was almost like a storage closet so I kind of felt like it wasn't just fair 
Got my salad from Sweet Green, and I'm about to FaceTime my roommates and figure out if we liked one of the apartments. And so I'm gonna talk it out with them and see. I really liked it. I like the vibe, I like the energy. Let's see. I'm just gonna eat this salad because I'm starving and I walked like 40 blocks today. So a <laughs> hungry gal. I just finished FaceTiming my roommates and I feel really good about it. It's literally like 8:30, and I just put some dressing on my salad. And we're gonna shake it up. I'm literally like starving. I'm so hungry. Oh. I don't even think it's gonna do sweet green salad. Take off this shade, same. <laughs> but that was a horrible shake. But we're still gonna eat. Got a fork. Mmm, so good. I love you, sweet green. Love you. Good morning. I am so tired today. I like put on my Instagram story that like my body is just not used to walking as much as I did yesterday because I was trying to save some money and not take the subways from place to place. So I like walked, I think it was like 60 blocks total the whole entire day. I came home and I just... I slept really nicely, but I woke up and I am still so exhausted. It is Friday and I have a full work day today. And then Ishika and I are going to be recording the podcast after work. A little update on the apartment. We're still deciding if we're going to take this one or not. I feel like it's just like a big step in general. So it's obviously like kind of scary. But I do think with this in, in this market, like this price and everything like that, I think is really good. We're going to see. Something that I really liked about this place is that all the bedrooms are like the same size and there were so many windows and so much like natural light and the location was just phenomenal we'll have to see i messily made my bed today so yeah little update let's have an amazing friday oh it's the end of the day and i'm about to head over to ishika's to record the pod and i thought i would show you guys my outfit i am wearing the same pants that i was wearing yesterday they're from princess polly they're like black trousers i really need to do my laundry so i don't really have that many clothes to work with and then i'm also wearing this like crop tee from princess polly and then my hair is kind of gross so i popped on a hat and yeah no makeup on today just chilling just vibing stressed out this like whole entire day and just like tired and like mentally and physically exhausted i think it was like kind of like from overexerting myself yesterday and then also from like i don't know with like finding apartments and i'm realizing with just like post-grad in general there's just a lot of uncertainty and i'm honestly like so confused with what i'm doing and just feeling so lost and kind of stuck at the moment but that's just how i'm feeling right now and i thought i would share it with you guys because i thought i'd be real i feel like my my room is a mess and I feel like that just shows you how my life is going right now. It's literally so messy. There's stuff everywhere. I took a long shower with the hopes that that would make me feel better and it definitely, definitely did. So I'm gonna grab the mic that Ishika and I used to record. Then I also need to pack my laptop because that's important. That's basically all we need, so. Let's go. I might eat something before because I'm kind of hangry. I am lazy at the moment and I have no energy to cook, but I don't want to spend money. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Should I make avocado toast for the second time today? Should we do that? I Should we, should we do that? Guys, I feel so crazy. I feel so weird. I've just been in such a weird funk all day. Like so tired, no energy. <sighs> I'm kind of just like in this place in my life where I'm just like so mentally and physically ready for like the next phase in my life. But like it kind of feels like nothing is really happening. I am just like tired of waiting. I'm like so grateful for like where I am in life and like opportunities that I have. I'm so grateful for my job and my parents and my family and my friends, literally everything. But it's kind of just like for me and just like my growth and my career and like my goals. I'm just feeling so stuck and just very in this place. And I am really looking forward to moving, but it's kind of just like in this like weird limbo period and I don't know what I'm doing. And I'm just trying to be super present about it because I know that everything ends up working out in the end. It literally always does, but this period is probably just like the hardest to work through at the moment. And yeah, we're always gonna have ups and downs and this is definitely a moment where I do feel kind of down and I thought I would share it with you guys but I feel like soon everything's gonna work out the way it's supposed to what's meant for me what's meant for you will not pass you so I'm gonna remind myself of that and make myself some food I've decided that I'm gonna eat when I come back so we're gonna head to Ish's I'm excited to record because whenever I record with her I'm always in a better mood yeah let's go 
drive to Ishika's. You know how I was kind of just saying that I've been feeling in kind of a funk? I took a shower and now I feel funky fresh. Yeah, let's put on some good music too. I want some bops, like some good energy at the moment. Let's do some R&B, some... This is Khalid. <laughs> I didn't <laughs> Um, Ishika and I just finished recording this week's episode. It was a really good one. But look at the difference between us right now. What? You look so like, oh. Oh, guys, you look like leisure. No, like oh. you. And there's me like. You know why? Because my hair was drenched and like so gross from the rain from oh. the city yesterday. So I and the humidity. To, I just like put a hat on and I was like, it's, it's working. Look. Yeah. It is working. It's a look. Go listen to this week's episode. It was so good. It was like a Q&A. But yeah. I'll see you guys very soon. I'm home. Recording with Ish was so much fun today. I feel like it was just like such a chatty episode. And now I am going to make myself some dinner. It's currently 8 p.m. and I'm very hungry and I don't feel like cooking. And I'm kind of like really in the mood for like a smoothie. So I think I am gonna make myself a little green smoothie. For some reason, our kitchen light is like not turning on. So it's so dark in here. Let's get all the ingredients. I froze a bunch of bananas the other day so I feel like we're gonna have a lot. Giant bag from a spinach from Costco. You get some peanut butter, some frozen bananas. I'm gonna do, I think some protein powder. And then I usually blend my smoothies up with water. Vanilla protein. I like to top off my smoothies with some granola cause I feel like it's just like, I like to eat my smoothies. I don't know if you guys are the same, but that's just how I am. Sorry, it's so dark in here, the light. This is not working. We're gonna do a frozen banana. A lot of spinach because I honestly don't think I <laughs> I got any green. Oh my God. This is just gonna be a very spinachy smoothie. We're gonna do some peanut butter and some protein powder. Oh well, there's like not that much left. Since I have like barely any protein powder in here, I'm gonna put that in here and then put a scoop, a scoop of chocolate protein. All right, peanut butter's in. If it's water and we blend. So as you can see, it's like super green and I'm gonna pour it in this little jar, not a jar, a cup. Super, super thick. I like my smoothies to be eatable, if that makes sense. I don't like them to be like liquidy. Taste test. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Good morning. It is Saturday morning and I am enjoying a cup of coffee and just gonna have like a relaxing day today. I might go on a walk later and then getting dinner with a friend. We did end up signing the lease on the apartment that we like just because the bedrooms were really small and we were just kind of unsure about it. But to be honest, it's still on the market. So we might still think about it today too. We're not really sure, but we're probably gonna keep looking. Ishika and I are thinking of planning on going to the city next week, which is Saturday the 18th, and just like booking up a lot of apartments and then just signing one of them, just so we don't have to go back and forth because taking a train right there, coming back, one is really expensive, it's very time consuming and very tiring, and we just wanna sign a lease on something and just have it all in one day, so that's the plan. I am about to go on a walk, just like a little walk, maybe like two or three miles or so, maybe 45 minutes, something like that, wearing some yoga pants that are literally <laughs> probably like so old, like five or six years old and then i'm wearing this sweatshirt from katarina i bought her merch because i absolutely love that girl this shirt says buy yourself some flowers and i think it's really cute and i'm just gonna go on a little walk i'm just like really in the mood to do something today i do have a lot to do i need to edit a video to get that up tomorrow and edit the pod before i go to dinner with my friend today i feel like it's gonna be like a very at homey day and then tomorrow i really am in the mood to like take some instagram pictures so i think i'm gonna like plan some outfits and then go to Tomorrow. Let's go on the walk first.